So this paper developer I'm holding in my hand right now is Agfa Newtal. And this is, again, a very, very good paper developer. And there's also a couple different things about Agfa paper that I, I know when I first started I found really interesting. Some Agfa papers have almost a green in it, like a green look, whereas most black and white papers have a degree of either warm or cold. But Agfa has a little bit of a green in it. And also one thing about certain Agfa papers is that they were really popular for a long time. And you see this, this is going to happen more and more with this art form. And then they stopped making the paper. And so what happened was a lot of these papers were bought in bulk by photographers, by printmakers, and still kept around to this day in freezers or in places where they know that the paper is still going to stay good. And as you get more into this, it's something you might want to, you know, look on the internet or look for a certain stock of paper that actually almost has like a, a following to it. And some of them are actually quite expensive. One thing about the Agfa Newtal is that it has these dilutions on the back and that you can actually control how warm, how cold, how, you know, how this paper is going to look. And I think that that's a very interesting thing. Again, it's a liquid developer, more expensive, and will actually aerate or go bad faster, like this bottle is actually starting to go to because there's more air inside than when you make a developer from powder.